Okay, last year the RIT men's hockey team was getting all the attention. This season it's the women's hockey team that's being recognized. The RIT women's team rose to number one in the nation for the first time in the program's history. Robin DeWin joins us with a look at what makes this team so good. Well, they are very good. The RIT women's hockey team thought they had a chance of being ranked number two this week after sweeping two-time defending national champions Amherst last weekend. But this week when the poll came out, RIT was ranked the number one team in the country in D3 hockey, and these ladies intend on staying right there. It's been a busy week for fifth-year RIT women's hockey coach Scott McDonald. It's been uh, a little hectic. You know, I've been getting a lot of emails from uh, from a lot of the alums, a lot of the girls at uh, former players. Um, so that's been nice that they uh, that we know they're still following the team. The Tigers reached number one for the first time in the program's history. Senior and Batavia native Katie Stack leads the nation with four power play goals and is just shy of becoming the program's all-time leading scorer. But Stack says stacking up milestones is not what this team is all about. I don't think about like team goals right now. Like my only focus is like our team winning and like nothing personally. Stack admits being on top means a target is on the team's back. She says the Tigers are ready. Seven freshmen have stepped up to complement the core group of seniors. We've been ranked top five since I've been here. Maybe freshman year was top ten, but and now the guys just like got like a break last year, but we've always been up there, so it's nice to finally get our due. The RIT men's team made it to the Frozen Four last year. The women's team is still D3, but plan to go D1 in the next few years. Honey Eye Falls native Alexandra Hills is a third-year forward. She says the team is gelling at the right time. All our lines right now have really great chemistry. Um, our team has really good chemistry. Everyone's getting along really well, and I think everyone has that common goal. It's not a, a me kind of team for everyone. We've worked hard over the past four years since we've been here, so finally getting the number one spot is a big deal for us.